This is a three-minute message brought to you by Redemption Church, Delray Beach. Hey, Redemption Church, Delray Beach. This is Jim Gallagher, Calvary Chapel, Vero Beach. I understand you guys are working your way through the Proverbs and want to take a moment to share with you sort of the heart behind the Proverbs as a whole. Solomon said that uh, his purpose in writing was to give, in, to give instruction and to give wisdom. He tells us that the start of wisdom is the fear of the Lord. In other words, we get in that position in life, we're trying to figure out what the right decision is to make. Should I go left, should I go right? You know, should I, should I stay here or should I move on? And, and we are constantly faced with those kind of decisions. And Solomon tells us that in the equation, as we're trying to come to that conclusion, we have to start with the fear of the Lord. The fear of the Lord's a big concept, it's pregnant with ideas, but to simplify it, the fear of the Lord is simply desiring to please God first. And so as we start to make those decisions in life, the first part of our equation should be, what will please God? Is this something that the Word of God addresses? And if so, what does it tell me to do? Um, Solomon went on in chapter 8, verse 13 of the Proverbs, and he said that the fear of the Lord is to hate evil. In, in other words, there's this contrast that happens between pleasing God, doing what He wants, doing what's, what's pleasing to Him, and then hating or avoiding that which displeases Him. And I, when I look at that verse, I always think about, you know, if someone were to put food in front of you that you really, really don't like, and you kind of just push it away, just push it back, just go, not interested. And as we're seeking to make those decisions, we, we want to please the Lord, and we want to remove those things that are unpleasing to Him from our life. So God bless you guys as you seek to honor the Lord with your daily decisions, and you seek to use the Proverbs to help you do it. God bless you guys.